look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Anyway, assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. My name is Adul Kareem, and today we're viewing stuff of Islamic nature. So, if you guys are not religiously inclined, feel free to hit one of my other ch videos. I have tons of them, hundreds of them, way too much because I don't have a life. But, um, yeah, I don't normally do like religious type stuff. But today, I figured why not. Anyway, so today we're reviewing this stand. It comes from Etsy. If you guys want the link, it's down below. So yeah, like you can close this like a book, which makes it nice. I don't know why you do this. Just leave it open. Looks better. This is kind of like the maximum angle you can do it at. And it has these floppity doops. So yeah, it helps keep the Quran in place. Also, it has this thing. Now, it's a bit loose. It's because I just unscrewed it from the back here. So, usually you get into a nice angle and tighten it up. Oops, sorry. Now, what I like about this is it only comes in three parts. You get the top part, you get this stem, and you get this base. No, actually, there's four parts, technically. And you get this one screw. And I didn't really read the instruction. It was pretty simple. Screw this in, screw this into this. Well, you actually have to unscrew this and then screw these two pieces together. And then, you know, this is this. So, what we're going to do is it has three screws. Whoa! Ah! It's hard to do this one-handed, so I'm gonna. Ah! <laughs> it doesn't want to stay still. That there's nothing to do with the product. It's got more to do with meands um, because you're not supposed to do this one-handed. So <clears throat> now you do need to screw it really tight in order to keep it in place, uh, and it can still move. So, yeah, it's a bit wonky like that. It is extendable. So, there's another screw down here. I know, I'm doing this like in the random mat in the bedroom. Right, I did this a little bit tight. And then, you can do that. Now, I'm going to do, hopefully, is I can keep this in place. So, there, there you go. It's, uh, I don't know, say... <clears throat> Just under a, a meter tall. It's not like extremely tall. So let's get a normal Quran, put it on here, and then just open it. Help us if I put the Quran the right way. Um, there you go. So this is my Tauji Quran. So you get these, they extend out uh, nicely, and it holds it in place. The only thing is, is when you want to turn the pages, it's a bit kafoodly. Either you have to do this, and then do this, which is fine, because it's not like one of these things where they're flopping the pages, unless you're doing this outside on a balcony in the breeze. And to be honest, as long as you just have these out to keep it in place, then you're fine. But, 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 there comes a problem. And I'll show you the problem. Now, I don't think that this Quran stand is meant for this kind of Quran. Look at the size of this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's hard to hold it in there. So, right. you see this. This is a abnormally large Quran. And it can hold in there nicely. Now, it holds in place, which is fine when you have one page. Uh, when you want to turn a page, you kind of... I don't know, have to kafoodle it back in. It's a little bit wonky when you're trying to... Because the, the automatic thing is to do this. I mean, you can do it like this. I just feel like I'm kind of... I don't know. Like... I don't know, just... I, I wish there was like an easier way to just kind of turn the pages. Like, I know this is trying to keep it in place. And the only other thing is, is, let me turn this sideways. I mean, it's great, but if let's say you're sitting down and you want a bit more of a kind of angle, this will flop. Like, ah! See, it's doing it now, and then the book will fall out. So, heavy crowns like this, I mean, this is, this is really uh, heavy. I mean, you could do weightlifting with this crown. Uh, so yeah, it's a heavy crown compared to most. This makes it a bit kafoodly to move it about. Um, and this 
does flip flop at times. Uh, if you have a, I mean, this is like, ah, I'm a strong guy, and this still is a bit loose. So, yeah. Well, now, what's my verdict? I think this is aesthetically pleasing, and I think that if you were a normal Joe, uh, Abdul Joe, you you'd be pleased with this. I mean, to work well. You know what? I keep doing these crowns backwards. I'm sorry, it's my western book brain that, because I'm used to the cover being on the other side. Anyway, so it works nicely and with a, let's say a crown like this, where it wants to open, you can keep it in place. Ah! And as you just saw, it flopped, which is why it's not getting high praise. Because I mean, <sighs> so I just got this this morning. I'm gonna rate it, uh, not the Quran, uh, but I will rate this stand, which I was kind of hoping not to do. I'm gonna say that it is aesthetically pleasing. Um, the only thing, the only, only thing is right here, this hinge has an annoying propensity to do this, even when it's fully, fully turned. And also these things. Other than that, other than that, I am pleased with it. So, and to be honest, when you're sitting here, like the way I'm sitting on the floor, my PJs on, you know, it's Friday morning, you want to relax, you want to, you know, read your Quran, you know, just have a nice, nice, nice Friday morning. And it's, it's a good, again, not, actually that was me, I loosened it just now a little bit. <clears throat> oh man, I'm using some serious muscle edge to keep it in line, bruh. But anyway, so, <sighs> I like it, but I will have to return it. I'm sorry, but it's not up to my specs. And it breaks my heart because I love this thing. It just looks so nice. So, it's going to get one, two, three thumbs up. And one thumbs down for that kafoodliness of that plus these. I'm just combining it. So that, that makes it, if you do the maths, two thumbs up. So, yeah. If you guys want your own, these come on Etsy, there's different styles. It would work if you didn't have huge crowns like we do. Um, but yeah, I do like it. So, there you have it, two thumbs up. Feel free to hit subscribe. Salam alaikum to all the Muslim brothers and sisters. And tell anybody who's not a Muslim who watched this far into the video. And yeah, I mean, thank you for watching. And I guess I'm just going to go now. Bye.